Hello hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Zia. If you are new to my channel, welcome to you too. If you are returning, thank you for coming back. And today's video, we're gonna be talking about uh, skincare. So I've been using these three products from Neutrogena from their Hydro Boost collection uh, or range. <laughs> Hydro Boost range and they have been doing the things, okay? Um, so these are the three products that I'm going to be talking about. So firstly, it is the cleanser, and then the Hydro Boost Supercharge Serum, and also Boost Plus Boost. So it's a two-in-one, and then the Hydro Boost City Shield Moisturizer and SPF 25. So this is also like a two-in-one. So. Firstly, let's get this video started. Actually, before we get this video started, if you haven't subscribed, make sure that you click the subscribe button. And when the video finishes, you can comment down below, give this video a thumbs up, and possibly share it with your friends who might benefit from it, okay? Let's get this video started. So firstly, I'm going to let you know about the cleanser. It's a hydrating cleanser. It's water-based and it is great. It is a clear cleanser. Like it's, it's clear. Let me show you how it looks. So this is how it looks like. Yeah, that's how it looks like. So I just pump one pump of it and I put some water and I lather my hands and water with it. So yeah, that's how it will look. But obviously with water, it will look even better. And I just put it on my face in circular motion and I wash my face for a minute so you all know the cleansing rule of cleansing your skin for a minute or cleansing your face for a minute um so i do the same thing with this but in the morning i double cleanse using my total cleanser from fancy beauty but we're not talking about fancy beauty today okay we are talking about neutrogena so um this is a hydrating as i said hydrating cleanser so what they say it does it boosts hydration leaves skin feeling freshly clean and touchably supple that is not a lie because it literally makes my skin feel so fresh and it feels so clean and so airy and it definitely leaves it supple it feels like a baby's bum <laughs> No lie, no exaggeration. It actually feels that good. And I love this cleanser. My skin is very sensitive, so I have to be very careful with what I buy and what I put on. And this cleanser, before I used it, I did a test um, patch, um, but nothing happened. So after that, I've just been using it for almost for two months now. Yeah, I've been using it for two months, almost three months. And so far, so good. I am definitely gonna buy this one. So it has um, glycerine, it has cocoa, uh, cocoa midopropylin. It also has um, hyaluronic acid and aqua, obviously water. Um, it also has starch, apparently, but yeah, like I, I haven't had any, um, I don't have any complaints from this. Um, I love it and I would recommend you guys to get it. And it is not that expensive also. I think I got it for about 189 I think if it's expensive for me, something if it's, it's expensive, it has to be above 200 So this is less than 200 Rand. And um, I would give this a 10 out of 10. Yeah, out of 10, this is a 10 for sure. So secondly, it is the Hydro Boost. Um, I haven't been using this for long. I think I've been only using it for um, almost a month. Yeah, so I don't really have um, a clear analysis <laughs> um, on how good it works. Um, it's quite thick. The, the one thing that I can complain about is quite thick. Um, it does have like little bollockies inside. And as you guys can see, the white bollockies thingy. Um, it reminds me of the, what is this? L'Oreal? No, Elizabeth Arden. Elizabeth Arden, um, the serum, the 
the eggy things that look like a that looks like eggs but it's like a serum and you it's like balls and you press it and then the serum comes out it reminds me of that I just forgot what the name was um, I really like that but um, this what I can say about this it is quite thick so I don't use like a lot of it I literally take like one pump of it and I make sure that I am one pump goes a long way basically one pump goes a long way and I'm just gonna show you how that is true so that's just and that is how it looks like I don't know if you guys can see yeah that's how it looks like and it's quite thick it is quite thick like quite thick and I don't like how it it feels yeah no I don't like how it feels it feels snaily <laughs> it feels kind of snaily like yeah not in a good way it feels kind of snaily in a in a very bad way and kind of like sticks but um yeah you have to use um SPF if you're going to be using this make sure that you have an SPF 25 or SPF 30 or 50 whichever one um so so far i'm just gonna rate this a six out of ten um yeah because it hasn't done anything bad to my skin so that is the six if it had done something bad then i'll probably give it a four but um a six so far and then the last product that i absolutely am in completely completely in love with it is this SPF and moisturizer from them. It is So good like when I put it on it feels like velvet on my skin you guys like it feels so good It feels so light. It feels like air But the one thing that I can say is after I put it on I Feel like I still need more moisture for my face. I I don't know why but I always feel like I still need extra moisture but it does make your skin look hydrated and like shiny and glossy and it looks really good um, you could probably eat it definitely do not put this in your eyes or on top of your eyes or lashes anything like that because it burns I learned the hard way this is a chemical sunscreen S slash moisturizer um and i was really scared about it because my skin is very sensitive um just to give you a little background my skin has eczema um so i get prone to eczema when my skin does not like anything that touches it that is uh, mixed with chemicals or perfume and this definitely has chemicals and perfume but it hasn't given me a bad reaction yet so I'm happy about that I love this guys like I would give this a 10 out of no not a 10 I would give this a an 8 out of 10 because I feel like a 10 is is pushing it <laughs> because of some issues that I have with it but I'll definitely give it a, a 8 out of 10 yeah and this i think i got it for about 149 no no no, 180 also i think it was 180 and then the serum this i think i got it for about 214 i think i'm not really sure but i will link it down in the description box where i got it from it's basically from any drugstore and take a lot also sells it um yeah so this is definitely an 8 out of 10 um and the only other complaint is that it's very small it's like 50 mils it's very tiny like it's not a lot so you have to buy quite a few <laughs> buy quite a few in order to not run out um yeah, so when I use this, I also use the hyaluronic acid from Inkylist, the serum, or I use the squalene um, serum from um, The Ordinary. Um, I will link where I get those from also. But yeah, that is my review on these three products. Um, so far, I would say they are good and I would definitely 
recommend them to anyone to use them because they are for all skin types yeah um, so if you like this video give it a thumbs up um, comment down below also don't forget to subscribe and share it with your friends thank you guys for watching